In the end, it felt as natural as watching someone expertly drive a car. Watching Vice President Kamala Harris deliver her acceptance speech for the Democratic nomination for president in Chicago, she didn't rely on symbolism or firsts. Instead, she spoke powerful words that mattered. It was almost ordinary, like watching a woman perform any skilled task, signaling that Harris's candidacy, while momentous, is also something women around the world do every day in democracies. Harris wore a simple dark pantsuit, her usual hairstyle, and understated jewelry, looking as she might while trying a big case or leading a Senate hearing. In a convention full of supportive spouses, there was relief that the candidate appeared ready for the job, not as a symbol, but as a leader. Throughout the speech, Harris touched on her gender, referencing her mother's working life, abortion rights, and the need to trust women. But overall, it was a speech that any leader might have given, with a nod to Hillary Clinton and the idea that we are now post-glass ceiling. David Rothkoff noted that it was more a lawyer's speech than a woman's speech, focused on law as a tool for the people. The most moving part was Harris's call for justice, highlighting the failures of the system in protecting vulnerable women and the need for collective responsibility. As a prosecutor, when I had a case, I charged it not in the name of the victim, but in the name of the people for a simple reason. In our system of justice, a harm against any one of us is a harm against all of us. And I would often explain this to console survivors of crime, to remind them no one should be made to fight alone, we are all in this together. Harris's speech wasn't just about how some have used the law to their advantage, but also about those left to fight alone, particularly women. It was a pledge to better serve them and a reflection on what democracy and the rule of law should mean. Harris highlighted the stakes, warning of the dangers posed by those seeking to control women's bodies through legal means. The strength of Harris's speech lay in its focus on what the law can do to women and for women, particularly women of color in America. It was a bold call for inclusivity under the law, delivered by a woman lawyer of color in an ordinary dark suit, speaking about law and democracy as though it's something women have always done and continue to do.